Welcome, or wrist, and welcome to another unboxing. Now, originally, I wasn't planning on recording this unboxing, but when I opened up the package and saw what was inside, it made me so excited and I thought, I might as well just share this experience with you all because I really was not expecting uh, this type of packaging. So first thing I saw was this Hanhart catalog and I think catalogs are kind of cool to get. It's kind of uh, awesome to see what brands offer in their range in a nice uh, booklet and uh, it just works as a decorative piece on like maybe a coffee table or just lying there gives a bit of the history as well although I didn't even buy a hen heart but it's cool that they just popped this in for me so I found this was a nice addition you know just something something little but makes a really good first impression all right let's put that let's just leave that here now this here look at this packaging it literally looks like you know a gift or a present that you're unboxing for yourself now I did buy this for myself it wasn't gifted to me but, uh, you know, they still packaged it well. They still wrapped it up. So, from Define Watches. All right, let's get into it. Let's open her up. Feels like Christmas. Let's see. Okay, let's see if I can slide it out. Yeah, can't quite slide it out yet. All righty. Let's put these to the side for now. All right, so Zin. <laughs> I got a Hanhart uh, booklet for a Zin item. Now, it, it's not a watch. It's actually a bracelet. So let's take a quick look at the actual box. Very similar to their watch boxes. Black, textured black box with the white uh, text there. Zin, let's do a quick 360. So all around, underneath, very similar to their uh, watch boxes. So keeping the same theme, let's take that lid off. Got a little invoice. Let's put that to the side. Here we have spring bars and allen key tools to size the bracelet oh inside is quite nice so we get the uh like that zin tool let's take a look ends have some different ends very nice to have rule apart there nice little compartment for it we get some loctite as well zin loctite thread locking nice little slot for that end links now you might be able to tell what bracelet this is based on the end links and let's see and the actual bracelet is there nicely protected in its own little compartment so let's take that out and it is the fine link bracelet no stickers to take off but that's okay all right let's put that there so it's quite a substantial box for you know just a bracelet this is some like uh firm or solid foam very nice to keep everything in. I think in. Yeah, you could take this out if you wanted, but I don't see why I should. Just keep that in there. This is actually quite a surprising package for, you know, just the bracelet, which is uh, quite nice to see. Because when I bought a rubber strap from Omega, I didn't really get uh, a package for it. It came in like a red Omega envelope. But this here, this really does make it feel, you know, like a premium item. And, you know, I will say the bracelets aren't cheap to begin with. So it's nice to see that they actually, you know, spend some time, spend some money, pay attention to their packaging, even when you're just buying 
uh, a bracelet. Usually brands will just send you the bracelet. They won't even give you like a tool. They won't give you um, some Loctite. But Zin, they seem to go far and beyond to ensure that you get everything with your bracelet. So here it is. Let's take a look at the bracelet. So this is the Fine Link Bracelets. And I plan to put this on my Zin 356, the chronograph. Look at that. So it is sized with the Allen keys usual for Zin. Let's check the deployment. Very nice. Snaps in well. Yep, deploys very smoothly. I can't wait to put this on. Now guys, that was just a quick unboxing of the bracelet. Again, I was surprised with the packaging. I think they did a good job. And the fine watches, they definitely um, did a good job as well. I was not expecting that hand heart uh, booklet or the catalog. And uh, they wrapped it up quite nicely. Guys, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more watch content. I'll see you in the next one.